right, y'all. It's been another rainy day. It stopped for the moment, and we are about to head to Aldi. And Aldi, the Aldi finds aisle. Ooh, we have a food storage set for $6.99. Stainless steel desk mug, $9.99. Look, they have little planners for $4.99. Cute. Let's see what they look like on the inside. Any stickers? No. Canvas bins, $9.99. Hay rides and bonfires. Sweet pumpkin cake. We'll give these a try. Oh, it's missing an eyeball though, but that's adorable. They're only $5.99. They still have some of these coffee signs right here. Those were an Aldi find from like several months ago. Lots of candy, lots and lots of candy. They have this peel and stick tile here. This is the only kind of gray subway tile. It's $14.99 pack. They have Christmas scents in the Woodwick candles that are only $5.99. Cinnamon wreath. Perth and Pine, Winter Fireside, little holiday bags. How much are they? Oh, I need a holiday bag. First holiday things of the season. They also have the regular candles, holiday cranberry, first snow, is that first snow? No, that's frosted vanilla, that smells good. Cappuccino pumpkin spice, hot cocoa pumpkin spice, K-cups, maple French toast bagels. Okay, y'all, we are back. It's almost time to cook supper, but I wanted to show y'all what we got from Aldi real quick. Tonight, yeah. for supper, we're having the Fall Food Friday recipe, so y'all be seeing that tomorrow. It's the last one, the last Fall Food Friday of 2021. So if you haven't participated yet and you want to, tomorrow is the last day. It's been so fun this year. We've had so many different recipes. I think there have been at least like 30 something each week. I think last week there may have been 40 or maybe close to 50 videos. I'm not sure, but a lot. We may be close to 200 videos on this playlist by the time we finish tomorrow's last one. Oh, thank you. Manly's riding his horse. He brought me his little firefighter. He. What? He needs a change. He needs a change? Okay. Hmm. Woohoo! Show us how fast he can go. Yeah, yeah. Woo! Last night it was so funny. He was flying around. I mean, he was going so fast. I was like, wait, wait. I just knew he was about to slam into the wall, but he can control that horse really good. See? You can make him do the slide stop, right? <laughs> <laughs> 
It was $30 from Walmart. So if you're looking for Christmas presents for one to two year olds, there it is right there. He loves it. So here's what we got from Aldi. I'm gonna show y'all these first because I'm gonna put these in the oven for an afternoon snack. It's gonna take me a little bit, a little while to fix supper. So I'm gonna put these potato tots. We have the spicy ones and the bacon ones. I think these are bacon, yeah, bacon and cheese. So I'm gonna stick these in the oven for a snack since it's gonna take me a little while to make supper and we'll let y'all know how they are. I think it said it only takes 10 to 15 minutes. Let's see, are these new? I've never seen them before at the Aldi that we go to, so they might be new, I don't know. Yeah, they only take 10 to 12 minutes and I already have the oven preheating, so it should be ready in just a minute. Okay, so we got three loaves of bread. I got one honey wheat and then just two white. I like to get the classic style instead of the, you know, with the rounded top. They're a little easier to make the Uncrustables that we like to make, so I got two loaves of that. I also got some of these Hawaiian sweet rolls. The Aldi that we go to hasn't had these in a while. I guess they sell out of them really quick. So I got a pack of those. We got maple syrup, lots of pumpkin-y things. They finally had the pumpkin spice whipped cream in. So we got that, got the pumpkin spice creamer, and they had pumpkin spice eggnog. Look, it says rich and creamy with cozy pumpkin spice. I don't love eggnog, but Titus and Jonah absolutely love it. Okay, we also got some of the pumpkin spice cream cheese spread, and I wanted to go back and get those, what, did, what were those bagels that I saw, maple or something? Anyway, I showed them to y'all in the store. I wanted to go back over there and get those once I got this pumpkin spice creamer, but I mean, it was so busy in there. I was like, it's okay. We'll just go ahead and get in line because it was all the way on the other side of the store, and I said, we'll get some bagels from somewhere else. Uh, let's see, I also got another can of the pumpkin while I was in there. I think that's all the pumpkin spice stuff that I got this time as far as food. I did get these, they have the Danimals smoothies and orange cream, and y'all know the kids love the orange cream whips, the Yoplait whips, and they love these little smoothies, so I thought they would like these. I got three boxes of them, and they were $1.99. Then I got these soups, I got a baked potato with bacon, broccoli and cheddar, and sweet uh, tomato and sweet basil. I got some chocolate chip cookie dough. Let's see, back here in the back, I got those Christmas um, bags. You know, these are the gallon storage bags and the quart size. Two things of the wax melts, hay rides and bonfires and sweet pumpkin cake. And then we got the frosted vanilla candle. I got two cans of regular crescent rolls, two cans of the sweet Hawaiian ones, and two cans of cinnamon rolls. Some of these cheese dip and cracker sticks. I'd never seen these before. It's like the Aldi Clancy's brand of Pringles. I could have just probably never seen them before, but anyway, I got the cheddar cheese, sour cream and onion, and original. Sour cream and onion looks like the Christmas kind. That's, he, he's doing all that snow and stuff. And then these were new. I'm pretty sure these are new. I've never seen them before. It's the kettle chips. These are the Cuban sandwich flavored and Nashville hot chicken flavored. Then I got some more of these pastry crisps. Two chocolate, one box of the blueberry ones, some cheese. I got this Asian stir fry and I got some chicken nuggets. I was going to get a couple of bags of our chicken from there, the Kirkwood chicken that we liked. They didn't have any this time. So I got a bag of the chicken nuggets. We got some grapes, sweet peppers, lettuce, celery, carrots, cucumbers, and Granny Smith apples. And the last things I got were these rolling duffel bags. They were only $19.99, and we're gonna be needing these sometime in the future. So I got two of them. We got this one and the gray and orange one down there. Much cheaper than the rolling suitcases and easier to store because when you get finished with these, you can just flatten them out, you know, and they can easily just slide into a you know, closet or under a bed space or wherever, you know, you want to store them. So that's it. That's all we got. While the tater tot things are cooking, I'm going to go ahead and put this stuff up real quick. Okay, y'all, these are cooling down. I went ahead and tried one of the spicy ones. They are very good. Tyler's trying bacon ones. What about them, Tyler? Good? They're good. Oh, it does lift up. I didn't know if it lifted up or not. And there goes Aldra riding. <laughs> Manly's being a horse too. What did Daddy teach you how the horsey goes? <laughs> Here we go, boats. Oh, boats. Oh, boats. Oh. Man, I wish that was all easy to shoot like that. Yeah. Yeah. Woo. Woo. All right, y'all.
y'all. That's gonna be it for today's video. We are about to go into fall food Friday mode. Hey, put new shoes on that horse right there. Daddy just now shot him. You putting him fast kind? You putting him fast kind on. Okay, here he goes again. He keeps his hammer right there, buddy. You let him throw a shoe, he'll he'll put it right back on there. I hear you. 